What's the crack lads? Welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we are looking at the Emperor himself, the King Adriano. This guy is a very unique and interesting player. Obviously he's not as hype and he's not as good as he should possibly be. But we're going to take a look at different builds. The build that you're seeing here on the screen is going to be the first one that we use, right? So obviously, um, when you take a look at this player here, he starts off as an 84 overall. He's a goal poacher. He's got fairly okay stats. Obviously, you're going to be uh, going to be transfixed on the kick and power. And that's what we've kind of really focused on in the first build here. So, I mean, as I've kind of decided to build up this guy and train him up, he does take a lot of trainer points. I mean, you're talking about nearly, what, 60,000, 70,000 um, trainer XP, which is quite a lot for a player like this. Um, so I do think it's worth it if you've got a lot of trainer points. But yeah, I mean, I do think that he is a good player. It just depends on how you play him, which we're going to see. We're going to have two different builds of him with some clips thrown in between as well. So the first build that we're going to take a look at, lads, we're going to really just kind of boost up his finishing because dribble-wise and speed-wise and acceleration-wise, he's not going to really cut the mustard too much, right? Now, I do have this build up on screen. It is the first version of him. This is the one you're going to see in the first couple of clips, and then we will touch back with a second version and a more recommended version, in my opinion, having played with him, okay? I've played about maybe 15 games now with him. Um, but all we've done is maximize his, his, his finishing, his offensive awareness and his speed and acceleration. And then also the kick and power to go to 99 to get that classic kind of Pez six Adriano. Okay. I don't think it's the best version of him. You will see some clips here in a minute, but yeah, there is definitely a better version of him, which we'll see again in a second. All of these clips that you're going to see are from the live stream where we were testing him. So hope you guys enjoy them and we'll be back with the better build in just a minute. I, do, I think that's the build I'm going to go with first. That's the build I'm going to go with first, where we've got 88 finishing, 90 curl, 97 kick and power. That's going to go up to 99 and we get the form arrow. Ooh. Yes, it's the king. Oh, it's the new king in town. Adriano. Well, I've heard people say that he's no good. I've heard people say that he's, you know, absolutely beastly on steroids. Um, I think his movement is going to be good, but as you see there, his movement is going to be good, but I'm going to have to play him like Collar. You know, that's that's it, in, in the fact that it's all going to be about depending on his AI. Oh, that's a lovely ball. And that's one. There we go. Straight away. Straight away, we get a goal with Adriano, boys. Ooh! No. See, you would say there that, like, Adriano, right? I know he's messing around with the ball there, but that little touch there from Adriano doesn't need dribble. Yeah, we're going to go full power and see how heavy it is. If it goes over, it goes over. Okay, it's a rocket. Out wide is only good if you want to have a bit of fun. Not even have a bit of fun, but... Oh, there was power now in that one. Not a bad player, though. There will be one minute at a time. Oh! Oh! Ho, 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 what a goal! Cheeky little nuts. Time to perfection. Oh, what a finish from Adriano, lads. All right, lads. So the second build that we're going to look at is a slightly modified Adriano, right? We're not going to double down too much on the finishing. And we're also not going to have that 97 kicking power because we are going to be getting the boost up to 90, you know, 7 or 98, depending on how you train him here. But it's also a 96 overall rated version of Adriano, but he's way more well-rounded. I mean, the biggest thing here is obviously the 12 shooting. That is dependent on how you like to play the game. You could get away with probably 84 and free up three more points, which would mean that you'll be able to pop one more into balance. That is probably the ultimate build I would go with him. Because look, you're either going to hit the target and have enough power with the 95 and the, the finishing with the form arrow. This is going to be an impact type player. You're also going to want to have that offensive awareness and physical contact really around the same mark as well. And I'm going to show you in a couple of clips just the pure strength of Adriano compared to other strikers that you might play in this system. See the strength there from Adriano, lads, that physical contact. 
There we go. Boom. There we go. He scored... Man, he scored in every game. Like, his movement isn't bad. I know I'm spamming him, and I know I'm really trying to highlight him for a video, but we are actually getting good finishes with him. <clears throat> what did you have for break? Tell you, lads, he's not bad at all, man. And also on top of that, you're going to have your ball control that's going to go up to about 86, 87, depending on the form arrow that you get as well. So that's something to keep in mind. Listen, 84 finishing for a player like this that's not your assassin up front, like Romario or Lomenegi or Michael Owen or Eto or any of those guys, Mbappe, that is more than enough to bring him on as an impact sub. You've also got the jump at 79 with the header at 76. You've also got the player skill heading and acrobatic finishing with first time shot. So that's going to give you a lot of first time ability uh, on the ball. So that is the ultimate build, I would say, having played with him for about 15 to 18 games. Let me know what you think. He's a difficult player to use. He definitely isn't a pick up and play player. You definitely need a system and tactics to suit his play style. But I have been banging goals in with him. I think I've scored like seven goals or eight goals in like six games so obviously as you go up the divisions it's going to get more and more hard to to do that but i de i definitely think he's a good player um and i do think that i'm looking forward to playing with him a little bit more so i hope you enjoyed the video lads don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and i will talk to you in a bit peace